Welcome back to N3 Electro Technology. Please don't forget to support this YouTube channel. In today's lesson, we'll be looking at a torque calculation. Now to define torque, it is the twisting force of the shaft. And this twisting force is about angular motion. Now if we look at the formula that's provided to us on the formula sheet, and we break it down and we look at each function inside the formula, 0,318 is derived from 1 over par. T represents the Newton meters in torque. RA is the armature current. Small letter P is the number of pole pairs. Z is the total number of armature conductors. Then we have the flux per pole in Weber. And then small letter C represents the number of parallel pods. Now take note that for a wave wound armature, C is equal to 2. And for a lap wound armature, C is equal to 2 times the number of pole pairs. Now this calculation comes from example 4.3 inside of our textbook. And the, the aim of this exercise is to determine the total number of conductors first. And then the second part of the calculation is to calculate the number of slots. Right, so what information is given? We are told that it is a six pole machine, therefore there are three pole pairs. It is a wave wound armature assembly. It has eight conductors per slot. However, the unknown factor is the number of slots. To calculate the total number of armature conductors, it will be the number of conductors multiplied by the number of slots. Now, to calculate uh, this unknown factor, which is the total number of conductors, we are given a torque of 450 newton meters, a armature current of 28 amps, and a flux per pole of 0 0.05 Weber. So here's our formula on the sheet, and we can see that that is provided directly from our formula sheet. All we have to do is manipulate the equation, and the unknown factor in this equation is Z, which is the total number of conductors. Right, so Z is equal to the torque multiplied by the number of parallel paths divided by 0, 0,318, the armature current, the flux per pole, and the number of pole pairs. So let's substitute our values. Now to calculate the total number of armature conductors, the torque is 450 newton meters. It is wave wound, therefore C is equal to 2 divided by 0, 0,318. The armature current is 28 amps. The flux per pole is 0, 0,05 Weber. And the number of pole pairs is 3. And that gives us a total number of armature conductors of 673,845. Now in the second part of the question, we want to calculate the unknown factor, which is the number of slots on our armature assembly. So to calculate the number of slots, it'll be the total number of armature conductors divided by the conductors per slot. And therefore we have 84,23 slots. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please remember to support this YouTube channel. Hit that like button and see you later.